Hey there, collectors. This is Sal Rodriguez of North Hollywood, California. I'm very excited to share with you my latest acquisition, and this is a Pink Panther action figure. It's bendable and posable, made by N.J. Kroos of Laverne, California. I'm very excited. I grew up watching the Pink Panther, not only, of course, in the opening sequences of the movie starring Peter Sellers, but on television as well. I've always been a big fan. Here's the back of the package. And there's some script there. I'll read you that. It says, In 1964, a character of unparalleled sophistication and unsurpassed pinkness strolled across the big screen to a slinky jazz beat in the opening credits of the Blake Edwards film The Pink Panther. The opening cartoon captivated audiences, and soon the character was featured in 1968 on NBC, which ran over 140 animated shorts. A second television show debuted in 1984, which featured many new characters and ran for over a decade. I'm very excited about this. Anybody with a, a television action figure collection or a motion picture action figure, figure collection needs to consider the Pink Panther action figure. All right, so we're going to open this up. Thanks for watching the Pink Panther action figure review. All right, so here's the Pink Panther out of the package. And as I said, he's bendable and posable. So there's literally an infinite number of positions that you can put him into. You're not dealing with the mere joint articulation of a lot of other figures. You can just go anywhere in any direction with this guy. And that's a lot of fun because that's how the Pink Panther is. He's not limited in what he can do or how he can move. He's the Pink Panther. Now, the only thing I'm not understanding are these little holes back here. If you can see that, he's got little tiny holes. I think that's obviously part of the manufacturing process, a remnant of the, the molds or having to do with the wires inside. I'm not certain. If anybody knows why th those holes are there, either for ventilation, ventilation, I don't know. Why would you need to ventilate this? I have no idea. But if anybody has an answer, please, please let me know. All right, so there he is. He can stand on his own. If you wanted to, you can use his tail sort of as a third means of support. Or if you have him up like this, he will still stand, but might not be as stable as you might like. Oh, so much fun, the Pink Panther. He's going to look great. I'm going to put him up on my stand up there, right up to all next to all the other movie greats, whether it be uh, Pinhead or Freddy's, Freddy's, I say, multiple Freddy Kruegers I've got. Whoever I've got up there. i got Perseus today from Clash, Clash of the Titans. i got all kinds of stuff. So I'm going to put him up with the rest. He's going to have a great time. I hope you've enjoyed this review. Anybody out there should consider getting the Pink Panther action figure. I think it's really great and a nice addition to your collection. All right, this has been Barefoot Sal Rodriguez of North Hollywood, California. Thanks for watching.